Switching gears, Slash Pine Press produces limited run chat books of poetry and mixed genre and occasionally hosts off the beaten path reading events, including the Slash Pine Poetry Festival. The Poetry Festival is coming up, and here to tell us more about it are Brian Morrison and Patty White on behalf of Slash Pine. Thanks for being with us today. It's our Thanks pleasure. For us. So, tell us about the Poetry Festival that's coming up. Well, right. it's a collection of 40 plus writers um, from undergrads to nationally renowned writers all getting together for several readings across the Tuscaloosa area. And where and when is it going to be? Uh, the first event will be Friday at 3 o'clock at Gorgas House on the University of Alabama campus and then from there we'll be going on to the Children's Hands-On Museum at 8 o'clock and then the next day we'll have four more readings. Um, the first one will be at the Gorgas Library at 11. The second reading will be at Green Bar. Uh, Green Bar. Green and Bar. then Downtown. from there we'll go to to Stillman College and the Cincinnati Auditorium and then we'll end the night with the Bama Theater. At about twelve thirty will be the last the, the end of the last reading will be about twelve thirty at night. So it's all day. Yeah. Very exciting. Why is it important to have a poetry festival like this? I think it brings together, um, in our mind, poets of different kinds of expertise and interests and levels of prominence. We have people reading who are undergraduate students here at the University of Alabama, um, all the way to poets who have received Guggenheim Foundation awards. And they're all mixed together and in different venues. There's no headliner in any particular one. And in our view, this is a way to democratize poetry, to bring it to everyone, for everyone, and to have it in spaces that reflect our interest in the way that space affects how we interact and engage with poetry. And that's why we have the five different venues. And so many different voices. So many different yeah. voices. Is there one message that you hope people will take away from this? From the festival or mm -hmm. from our encounter here? Oh, from the festival, from the of festival. course. <laughs> that, that from our encounter here, the message is that we hope that people will come out yes. to the festival. And from the festival itself, uh, that poetry is an ongoing part of life, that it's part of the public forum, it's a community activity, and it's really accessible to just about anyone. Um, the, the, the poems will be all about any kind of subject matter, and people can listen and enjoy, come and go. It's not that formal. We want people to enjoy it. Well, Brian and Patty, we appreciate you being here with us today. And hopefully people will join the Slash Pine Fest Poetry Festival. It starts tomorrow, March 30th, or actually Friday, March 30th, and runs through April 2nd. Each day features different events in different locations. For times and more information, check out Slash Pine Press online at slashpinepress.com.